how did the Home Office get itself into this mess with up to 4,000 people being detained at Manston? Who, who, as Home Secretary, obviously you carry the can for this, so is it your responsibility? Is it a previous Home Secretary? Is it Grant Sharps for his short tenure as Home Secretary? Who, whose fault is it that, we're in, that we have this crisis? Well, um, th I think that's a fair question. I'm not going to point the finger of blame at any one person. That's, it's not as simple as that. Uh, as I've been clear, I arrived in full awareness that there was a growing problem at Manston with the numbers arriving. That's combined with very limited uh, housing stock, which is available to people to, to transfer them on from Manston. Um, we've had, uh, you know, we worked incredibly quickly uh, and intensively during the month of September and October and ever since to procure uh, extra accommodation. And since the 6th of September, over 100 new hotels uh, providing 9,000 additional bed spaces have been brought into use. Uh, there was, you know, we had uh, high levels coming in. We have been aided by the fact, as Dan says, by very low levels of people arriving. Um, and it's that's given fault. us a brief... It's no, not your I, fault. I'm not, uh, listen, I don't think this is a. I don't think it's helpful to point the finger of fault to anyone. Just this is a to bigger understand. problem. I'll tell you who's at fault. Yeah. yeah, it's very clear who's at fault. It's the people who are breaking our rules, coming here illegally, exploiting vulnerable people, and trying to abuse the generosity of the British <clears> people. <throat> That's who's at okay. fault. 